Science. Preventative drugs should be made available to women at a higher risk of developing breast cancer. This is the finding of an international panel of cancer experts recently published in the British medical journal The Lancet Oncology. Drugs such as tamoxifen and raloxifen have been approved in the US for the prevention of breast cancer, but not in the UK. But tamoxifen has been linked to an increase in cancer of the womb, blood clots and strokes. Well, it's vital that we do find more ways to effectively prevent breast cancer in the future, particularly women who are at a high risk of developing the disease. But it's important to remember that this would not be appropriate for everyone. Doctors are trying to pinpoint risk factors and say so-called breast density could be one way of identifying people with greater chance of developing the disease. Coral Shah was given tamoxifen when she was diagnosed with breast cancer when she was 29. She has mixed feelings to the new proposed use. I think they mustn't push it on people who don't really know, even if they've got high risk, because they may want to plan a different lifestyle. If it prevents people from um, having children or gives them a really bad poor quality of life, then I don't think it's fair to push that on them. One scientist estimates that for every 1,000 women given tamoxifen, there'd be 20 fewer breast cancers, but three more womb cancers and six more cases of deep vein thrombosis.